I remember when they were at this level, I never thought they could get to the level that they're at right now in the Chester Blackville and then go even past that. So you guys have some neat things coming up. We're going to show you some tonight. But again, as you sit there, I'd like you to close your eyes for a minute. So you guys close your eyes and join me on a journey. Close your eyes. Sit. As a matter of fact, sit up nice and straight. So you kids that are on the floor, let's just sit up nice and straight so you can put your hands like right on your lap. So close your eyes and focus in on what I'm going to say. Close your eyes. What I'd like you to do is get a picture in your head. Every one of you kids has done something in the martial arts or in your daily life, your running, your sports, your school, where you did really well. You really did well. And when you finished it, you were very proud of what you did. So what I need you to do for a minute for me is I want you to recapture a time, a thing that you did that made you feel really, really good, where you excelled at something, okay? Now, the problem that some people have when they do this, people talk about visualization, and visualization is great because they get an image in their mind and they see it, and they, but you know what? They don't feel it. I need you to feel it. I need you to let your mind capture how well you felt when you were really at your peak performance. Okay, so just sit with that feeling for a little bit, because if you do this occasionally, kids, if you spend every day just a little bit of time thinking about something that made you feel really great, okay? I'll give you an example as you're thinking about your thing. My, my daughter is in college. She has a dog named Ralphie. Ralphie is a pit bull boxer, and he's a crack up. And every time he comes over the house, he's just full of energy, full of energy. I can spend two minutes with Ralphie, and I'm energized, because Ralph has the fire. He has the energy. So if you kids have pets, or if you have experiences, or if you've ever been on a really neat vacation, or you, you did something again in sports or school that was really cool, I want you to feel that feeling right now. Just feel the feeling. Just sit there and let that come into your body. Wrap your head around it. You know, as you're doing that, see, the, the, what, you're, what you're experiencing right now should be bringing some kind of emotion some kind of passion to you. And then, when, when you're doing that, I want you to think about, you're gonna, you're gonna take your high energy output that you had in that thing that you were doing, or that, that dog that you were with, it doesn't matter. And then when you come out here on the floor, you gotta have that too, okay? So when you come out on here to the floor tonight, this is gonna be 40 or 45 minutes of go, go, go. And when you go to bed tonight, you're gonna sleep really well, because you're gonna be tired. Your head hits the pillow, clunk done. My wife laughs at me sometimes because we'll have people over. You can open your eyes now. My wife laughs at me because we'll have people over the house and sometimes we sit on the floor or we're done with dinner or whatever and, and she'll say, watch, if he lays down, he's done. Because as soon as I hit the floor, the party's over. Because I'm tired. See, when you guys hit the, hit the bed tonight, tired. Lights out. So, come on out here.